Linking two inputs together is essential when recording a stereo source, such as a keyboard or a stereo pair of microphones. Linking allows the input levels for both inputs to be set and adjusted at the same time without affecting the left-right stereo balance. Inputs 1 and 2 are automatically linked by default when using the GRNXY preset, but this can also be done manually. Here I've loaded the GRN Multi preset. I'm going to show you how to link inputs 1 and 2. To do this, go to the second page of the input settings for input 1. Touch Linking, then touch 1, 2. Now inputs 1 and 2 are linked. The input 1 level control knob can now be used to adjust the input level of inputs 1 and 2. The input 2 level control knob can now be used to adjust the balance between the two inputs. To make sure the balance is centered, position the input 2 level control knob at 12 o'clock, or halfway. You will see the letter C appear at the top of the home screen when the balance is centered. Now let's have a look at the meter display. As you can see, there is no longer a thin black line separating inputs 1 and 2. That tells me that the inputs are linked. If we want, we can also link inputs 3 and 4 in the same way by going to the input settings for input 3. As you can see, inputs 3 and 4 are now linked and there is no longer a thin black line separating them. The Mix Pre will automatically copy some of the input settings between inputs when they're linked together, such as the input type, record arm, and mute. Additionally, the pan settings will be automatically set to hard left and hard right for each input. To unlink the inputs, simply turn off linking in the input settings as shown.